Welcome to the Original Gangsters Podcast. I'm your host, Scott Bernstein. We are going to go up to Western New York for this quick hitter edition. After years of speculation and rumors, Outlaws Motorcycle Club boss Tommy O, John Ermine, a.k.a. Tommy O, has finally made his way officially into uh, this Buffalo Strip Club alleged mob-connected drug sex trafficking case that's been percolating for the last couple of years. Uh, the headlining defendant in that case is strip club owner uh, of Pharaoh's Gentleman's Club uh, outside of Buffalo, Peter Gerace Jr., who is the nephew of the reputed Buffalo Mafia Don Big Joe Chidaro, a.k.a. Joe Pizza. And uh, Tommy O's name has been around uh, Pharaoh Strip Club, as well as the uh, Chidaro crime family, the Magadino crime family, sorry. Um, for a while now, uh, Tommy O is the general manager of the Pharaoh Strip Club. A lot of outlaws work for him there. And there's been a lot of people talking that uh, Gerace Jr.'s legal problems dovetailed with a potential legal problems for Tommy O. And it, hap it happened last week. Um, federal agents executed a search warrant related to the uh, strip club racketeering case that's headed to trial next uh, next month, executed a, a, a warrant at Tommy O's Lancaster, New York residence. Uh, they, as well as uh, some other residents around uh, the area, and uh, they found uh, illegal firearms as well as some drugs. He is now facing uh, those charges. Uh, it's also of note that a motorcycle club boss up in Allegheny County, the rare breeds boss, Michael Ronconi, uh, he was indicted along, or sorry, he was arrested as part of these raids as well. Um, and there's so much news happening in real time related to this uh, this Gerace uh, Jr. case. It's crazy. You've had uh, people connected to the case die under suspicious circumstances. You have number of people that are being uh, in, arrested, at bond revoked, charged with witness tampering, including Gerace uh, Jr., who's uh, got his bond revoked back in the spring for allegedly ordering uh, dead rats put on the uh, the windshield of a star witness. His former personal assistant, Crystal Quinn, she died suspiciously back in the summer of an overdose that's being looked at as a possible homicide. This rare breed motorcycle boss uh, in Allegheny County, where is uh, is where Crystal Quinn uh, uh, died in August. Uh, one of the people that's been arrested recently and that was with Quinn in, in the uh, last hours of her life. Can, can be connected to the rare breed and, and Ron Coney. His name was Howard Hinkle. Um, so it's just, it's, it's insanity, but uh, there always been a lot of innuendo that the outlaws were right in the middle of this whole thing. Tommy O, the international president of the outlaws, uh, one of the most prominent, uh, prevalent, powerful, respected crime lords on the globe right now. Uh, it's interesting that we have we have three biker bosses in North America that are just forces of nature uh, doing their thing right now in the prime of their uh, biker boss careers in in Tommy O, uh, who had you know been able to, to stay out of handcuffs um, until last week, uh, and then Keith Conan the Barbarian Richter out of New York and the Pagans. Uh, and his blue wave mandate, and then Marty Robert and the Hells Angels uh, up in the Great White North. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, again, Tommy O's name had been bandied about. The outlaw's name had been bandied about uh, related to the sex trafficking, alleged sex trafficking and drug trafficking out of Pharaoh's strip club. Now Tommy O is facing charges uh, stemming from a search warrant related to that case. Gerace Jr. goes on trial in January of 24, along with retired DEA agent uh, Joe Bon Giovanni, who's being accused of pocketing a quarter million dollars to, to protect, uh, to protect uh, the, the, the rackets that were being run at Pharaoh's, as well as other uh, alleged mafia-connected rackets around Western New York. So Tommy O, uh, waiting to get a, a mugshot of him so we can show you guys, uh, is behind bars right now, arrested for a gun possession, 
um, in relation to a raid tied to this Buffalo racketeering case. Scott Bernstein, OG Pod out. Thank you.